The, what's holding this skin at the moment is a blood vessel. You can actually see the blood vessel going to the sub subcutaneous layer, layer there. So I'll, I'll, I'll cut that blood vessel. Move that with the ring. Then we have bunches of muscles, but I'll, I'll pick it up in a minute. I have, what I have here, not completely exposed, this bone, there is, the end of the bone is visible, one part. This would slot into the shoulder blade. So, Liana, which bone of mammalian bone is this bone here? Humerus or? Humerus. It's short in, in, in this front leg of the pig much longer in our cells. So shoulder blade is up here, the shoulder, and there, there are sets, uh, like this is musculature, some of which is shoulder muscle. Biceps and triceps. Biceps and triceps. Which one is at the back? Triceps. Biceps at the front, triceps at the back. One for doing that, one for that. The elbow joint is here. What type of joint is that? Elbow joint as to the axis in which it can move. I'm the hinge joint. It can only move in one plane axis. It cannot do sideways. Only backwards forwards. One, one axis. Right. Now, some of these muscle bands, it actually shows, I isolated one down here. We have a tendon, Te uh, tendon. Tendon joins uh, muscle to bone. So that if this, you can see this muscle here. Um, so can I give it a high five? This is, this is the tendon. Uh, it's not that easy, but it causes <laughs> the trotter to do okay. this. Yeah. What sort of muscles are these? <laughs> Striated. <laughs> there are bands in here which can, uh, with a chemical reaction, the bands go closer together or contract, which means the muscle, you know, it, when it contracts it pulls on the tendon joint, the hinge joint. here is different to bone. Cartilage. Cartilage, articulate cartilage. Well, because they move against each other, it's called articulating cartilage. 